so today I'm going to be doing a Sephora haul. So, yeah, I have a couple things, but this is not just from one time. This is from a couple visits to Sephora, and I'm really excited about all these products that I got. Um, I got two of them today, and the rest were from this other visit on February 19th, I think. So, yeah, um, I'm going to start with the things I got on February 19th. Okay. So the first thing I got was a mini Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion. I never even seen this. It's not really too exciting. Yeah, it's just a little mini primer potion. It's a brush like that. I mean, it's a mini one. Because I wanted to try it out before I bought the big one, which I'm not so sure if I like it because it's a little watery. Is your guys' watery? Comment down below and tell me because I don't really know if it's supposed to be watery like this or not. Yeah, but that's that. Then I also got this Sephora Professional Foundation Brush, which, um, like this brush, I like a lot. And it's a really good foundation brush because it's definitely good for our liquid foundation. I use it every day, and it just looks like this. It says Sephora right here. And on the back. It says what it's used for. And it's for foundation. And um, I'm not going to need this anymore in a while because um, I'm getting Sigma brushes. I ordered them on Friday and they should probably be coming tomorrow. I'm so excited. I just want them to be here already. You know what I mean? Um, but yeah, and that has a foundation brush in there. But I'm going to still use this until it gets really bad and then I'm going to use my Sigma one. Or I think I'm just going to use my Sigma one sometimes and then I'm this one sometimes. You know what I mean? Because I don't want to just waste it. It was $25. But it's definitely worth $25. So if you guys need a foundation brush, get this one. It's really good. Okay, and by the way, this eyeshadow little prime impression thing, this was $9. So, yeah, I forgot to tell you the price. So I'm just going to tell you the price now. In the box, it came in. It was pretty cute. Like this. This is decay. And the sides are so pretty. Yeah. Anyway, that's the other things I got. Um... Okay, so I got a NARS Pro Prime Pore Refining Primer, and it's oil-free, I guess. Looks like that. Yeah, and um, this is $32, and I, my mom bought this for me because it was my birthday, and so she bought it for me, which is really sweet. And um, she bought this for me, and it was $32, and it's a great primer. This is, like, the best primer I've ever tried. And I think it's really worth the money, but some people could disagree. You kind of have to be a primer freak or a person who likes primers, like, to actually want to spend this much money on a primer. But you only, like, it gives you one ounce for $32, and you need the tiniest drop, and it, it goes all over your face. So, if you do get this NARS Pro Prime, don't use too much of it, or you're just wasting it, because you need the tiniest bit, and it just goes all over your face, which is amazing. Um, and then the next thing I got the same day, which is the last thing I got the same day, is this NARS Sheer Glow Foundation. It's like this. The box is really dirty. And I keep it in the box just because it's glass bottle and I'm a klutz. So I would drop it and then it would break and I'd be so mad. Um, but this was $42 and my mom bought this for me as well because it was my birthday again. Um, <laughs> and it looks like this. And I got the color, um, they actually tested it on me and they found this color for me, it was like my perfect shade. And this is the color, this is the color, um, Fiji. Here. And you guys probably can't read that, but it's called Fiji. And it's like light fiber or something like that. And the bottle is glass and it's just really cute. And this foundation, I can't say enough good things about it. It's really good. Um, and I really like it because I think it makes my skin look airbrushed and looks like really flawless and really amazing. So I really like this foundation. It's like $40, like I said. And it's really worth the money in my opinion. But in your opinion, it might not be worth it. Okay, now today I got two things, and the first thing I got was $10, and it's the Benefit to Go Stay Put Set, so it looks like this. This is only supposed to be online, but it was at my Sephora, so I don't know. 
But the packaging is really cute. It's like pink and black stripes. And then it has two products. The first product um, it comes with is, let me open it. It has wrapping on it. It has wrapping on it. And I'm not really sure if I can get this off. Hmm. Hold on, I will get it off. This is the last thing I do, right? Yeah. Here. It's carrying pop. There we go. I got it. But I just have to pull it off. Okay. And it looks like this. It's just a tiny, this is the tiniest bottle ever. It looks like, oh wait, that's not the sign. There you go, it looks like this. This is Stay Don't Stray. This is an um, primer for eye, it's for like your your eyeshadow or for your, um, for your eyes or for, well, for a concealer. And I really wanted to try this because I love trying primers out. So I'm excited about trying this out. And yeah, it's just a mini bottle of it, but it's cute. And it's just um, a nice primer. I'm really excited to use that or try it out, I guess I should say. Then it came with a mini erase paste, which I really wanted to try this because um, I sometimes get acne. They say this really like makes it look it's not there. So I really wanted to try it. And because it has the name erase paste, it feels like, oh, it's going to erase it. Obviously, it's not, but yeah. And it's a concealer, and this they give you the color number two medium. And the thing is, um, oh, I think this is so annoying. Um, the thing is, you're like medium, my skin might be, like, you might be like, my skin's really pale. But I thought the same thing, and I, like, looked at the light one in the store, the swatch of the light one, and the light one is, like, pale. It's like, white is the computer I'm using. I'm using a Mac. It's, like, almost as white as that. Isn't that crazy? And, yeah, but it's actually, the medium's, like, everyone's shade, I think. Yeah, and the funny thing was, like, right before, um, right before I got this set, they sold the last one in the shade, and she was like, oh, well, that's the only way you can try that, so, good way to try that. And, yeah, and that's my shade, so if you guys are worried about the shade, don't worry about it, because unless you're really pale, the light one's not going to be your shade, just saying. Okay, and the next thing it, they give you is this, um, little sample, is of the Creaseless Cream Eyeshadow by Benefit, and this is in the color RSVP. And this is a pretty pinky, champagne -y, bronze kind of color. It looks browny, but it's more pinky. Like, it's a nice pink champagne color. I'm really excited to use that. And it's such a cute little mini sample. Like, it's so cute. Oh. Really cute. And those were products I all wanted to try all of them, so that's really exciting that I got that. And it's ten dollars. Like I think even if I didn't want to try the products out, I might just get this just for fun. It's so cute. And this would be a cute little gift to give someone. Um like you get this and you could get one other thing from Sephora and give it to them and that'd be really cute. So that's cute. Then the other thing, I'm kind of situated again. I didn't like all my videos. I don't know why. Okay, the next thing is again from Benefit. I've been like, I guess I loved Benefit today when I went. And it's the Filling Cheeky Minis by Benefit. That's the name. And it comes with these three mini things. And this is what it looks like. How cute is the packaging? So cute. It comes with the post benetint, the high beam, and then the post tint. And they're really cute. They're like minis. They're so cute. Look at that. Look how cute that is. Um, and I really want to try the posy. I really want to try the posy tint and the high beam, but I didn't want to spend that much money on like them without knowing if they were that good. Because um, Mac Barbie 07 had the, the posy tint. She like loved it, so I really wanted to try it. And well, now I get to. And it's a little. This bottle is so cute. It's like pink. It's like mirrored pink though. It's really cute. And it has this posy tint with a little flower. And this is just, like, it looks like a nail polish bottle. I'm sure everyone's seen this, but I'm going to really explain it. It's the polish bottle, and then it comes with the brush, and it's just, like, a really pretty pink. I'm making a video. Go away. Go away. I'm making a video. That's, 
I'm making a video. This is a really pretty pink, and yeah. Like a really pretty highlighter pink. So pretty. It's really nice. Sorry guys about that whole thing. My brother, he didn't know what I was saying. And it's like neon pink. It's bright pink. And it's just so pretty. It goes on your lips and it also goes on your cheeks. And I'm really excited to use that. Then it also came with um, the high beam. And this is just a really cute highlighter. It just highlights your cheeks. And this is a pretty, really pretty pink highlighter kind of color. I'm swatching. I'm going to show you guys the swatch in a second. Once I swatch all of them. And then it comes with Benetint, which is like red, like cheek and lip tint, which I'm not really so sure if I'm going to like this one. I don't really think I ever would like this. And this one's like really liquidy. So, yeah. And that's what it looks like, those three. This here. This one right here is Posy Tint. And then... This one right here is High Beam, and then the other one right there is the Benetint. Yeah, so I don't really think I like the Benetint that much, but that's okay, right? You know, you're not going to like every product you get. But this was $15, so you could get, like, your friend these two things and give them to them, and they would be like, oh, it's so cute, you know, because they're, like, minis, and they're really cute. I like them. So, yeah, that's all I have from Sephora for this haul. I hope you guys enjoyed, um, and all those things you guys can still get from Sephora, so... Go check those things out, especially these two things, because I think those are really cute, and I like them a lot. So I hope you guys enjoyed, and make sure you just subscribe, comment, um, request some videos, please, because I don't know what other videos to do. So please request some videos. Um, Alright, thanks for watching.